Okay. Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. Um, this is my father, and we are here in Lake Tahoe. Dad, you're talking to uh, this community of, of people that uh, this newsletter goes out to. Hi, everyone. <laughs> exactly. So I wanted to have this conversation um, with my dad and with you all because my father's been an, an integral part of this dream, obviously. I've been doing this for 31 years, but it hasn't been easy along the way for either one of us. And Dad, you know, you can imagine there's a lot of these people that get this newsletter that want to be actors. And, you know, their parents uh, either uh, don't approve of it. I mean, literally don't approve of it. Like some, some people, if they, when they announce this to their parents, um, you know, there's a big pushback. And other people, it's, you know, it's, it's everything in between. So would you, from your perspective, from a parent's perspective, what's it like to have your kid walk in and one day and say, I want to be an actor? <laughs> Well, it was quite a shocker, and I probably didn't handle it all that well, but uh, I'm so happy that you're enjoying your life and have worked so hard to prepare yourself to be an instructor that uh, I'm very, very happy that this is what you chose as a life profession. But what about from your, like, so that's now 31 years later, but when you, what did, here, let me, could you please give advice to all of the people who watch this to their parents right now? What advice would you give to a, to a dreamer walking into their parents who just want their kid to have a safer, easier life than they did? And when they announce they want to be an actor, it's quite a blow. What advice would you give to the parents of a young actor? Well, I would uh, support them in their endeavor. Uh, I think that's the most important thing that you do. You show your love and appreciation of them as a person. And, uh, you know, you just follow your dream. And as far as, um, you know, watching my journey, right? Correct. You know, what, uh, can you share anything at all that have been, uh, I don't know, either your, your biggest concerns for me, uh, as I went after this or things that brought you uh, joy or maybe understanding as to why I was doing it anything you could share about any of that your journey of my journey well I think the most important thing is again the support and love to you uh, that that wasn't always there for you and I'm regretful of that but I'm so happy to see you successful at what you're doing, and that makes me proud and happy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've had a journey. There's no doubt. You know, um, when I first started doing this, uh, my dad and I, we uh, we struggled for a while, finding our way with each other, with making right. this work for each other, and we lost some time. There's no doubt. My father's my my father is 90 years old. Yes, I know. I'm starting to feel it. <laughs> oh, you look great. You look great. <laughs> but anyway, in that, in our time, in our journey, um, we definitely had some periods where, you know, he didn't really get me. I didn't really get him, and and it was tough on both of us. You know, the good news is right. that we have um, made a beautiful comeback many years ago, of understanding and healing and all that. I guess it really, this is really when I thought of the idea of, of sharing you with the the community that receives this. I just thought. You know what an interesting perspective here's somebody that that now all these years later couldn't be more proud of what i'm doing more more Correct. happy for my happiness and yet it was not easy for you or for me or for us in our journey getting here right? that's true yeah yeah and so yeah. It, one i'm not to beat a dead horse but is there anything else you could share to the parents of a dreamer who who yeah, any advice you can share to the parents? One more time. Uh, I just uh, think giving them love and affection and support, uh, that makes up for so much. And someone chasing their endeavor and enjoying the experience, rather than feel like a lone ranger getting beat up by a parent. I don't think there's any place for that. But so many parents just want their kids to have an easier life. How do you, you know, you, you see, when you heard I want to be an actor, all you saw is a life of struggle and heartache, and, and there's certainly been a lot of that. Um, you know, how do you, how do you talk to the parent on that one, on how to support their kid when they see a life of a lot of 
well, you know, it's a tough, tough profession. Well, it is a tough profession, and that's why you don't need a parent in the background kind of hammering away at you on uh, what you chose for your life's vocation. So uh, I think it's pretty important that you get that support from the very beginning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, this is my father. The greatest qualities that I have as a dreamer have come from him. Um, work ethic, um, commitment, integrity. Um, yeah. 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 I love you. Love you, son. That's dad. Okay, see you next week.